Creek. Nice. This is a song. You ever heard this one? I've heard this one. This used to be called M.I.A. Oh, that yeah, because that, that beginning sample sounded like M.I.A. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah. This is Teen Creeps I'm... off of Nouns. Uh, we're going to try to remember what the deal is with this song. Why it is the way it is. Yeah, well, tell For me. You. What, first, first what, where the name come from? Teen Creeps um, was... There was a band where I grew up in Saugus called Teen Creeps. And I was in a band when I was 13, and we played a show with them. And they were also just dudes from my high school. Um, I don't remember anything what they... I don't remember what they sounded like at all, but I do remember they seemed really... They seemed older and cool. And Dave Keck was in that band. This other guy named... Fred, who was some transplant to our high school that seemed like in my 12-year-old mind or whatever, he seemed like he was like 30-year-old. Um, and then this guy named Eric Cott, who's, I don't know, he's, he's, he's just, I'm That's just good. trying to remember. These guys, Break there's some band. the band, Teen Creeps. Yeah, but I don't really remember what they sounded like, and oh, right. I just remember like you know, the name came up again, and I think this song had some feelings of uh, some saugus suburban sort of uh, uh, moments in there with lyrically so I don't know good title good name yeah and then there's a band we played with in um, Antwerp yeah they also, they also the took name the name Creeps. yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't think they were referencing the band from saugus I think they were probably referencing a song title yeah and then I also saw there's a podcast about young adults um mystery or like horror novels it's called mm. teen creeps i think a lot I of people have used the do. name since then yeah but i think that i don't think the podcast has anything to do with us oh really they just started it on their own i think so because it's like for like Come teenagers on. like young adults uh horror oh yeah i don't know as you pointed out to me earlier pre-recording that this was our the number one song on spotify with the most listens <laughs> so true. if someone's going to use that name man you know you know they heard about it from us <laughs> through, on Spotify. On Spotify. <laughs> Brought to you by Spotify. Spotify.com. <laughs> I mean, yeah. This tail thing at the end, this is on Teen Creeps? Yeah, we never played this, huh? Or do wow. we? I forgot this is at the end of this song. <laughs> do we? <laughs> <laughs> do we play this one? We used to, right? We used to trigger that at the end. Yeah. Beautiful. I love that. Yeah, haven't heard that in a while. Um, where did this uh, beginning sample come from? No idea. I'm really, I'm really kind of useless on this uh, commentary <laughs> podcast or this commentary track. <laughs> I have no idea. I don't know. What about that guitar riff? <laughs> no idea. Yeah. <laughs> where did that come it from? It sounds very not distorted on the recording. It sounds no, very not clean. At all. Like I punched in just a quick do 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 do, kind of like a mandolin or something. I don't know. I mean, I had definitely had a fascination with Irish music or whatever I thought Irish music was. Yeah. <laughs> apparently, <laughs> in, in the beginning of this band, I had uh, these kind of basic, uh, you know, uh, basic uh, riffs, and then they were often pointed out like it sounds kind of like a jig. <laughs> I, I think it's kind of just my. Uh, Did you investigate my, that further? Uh, my diatonic like uh, guitar scale playing skills. Kind of put everything into that world. This song always felt like a doo-wop song to me. Ooh, really? How come? Yeah. Papa, pucha, pupu, kaka, pucha. Maybe the drums and the ben na 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 feels like a song I'd hear from the Kingsmen or something. Shabop, shabop. Ooh. Wow, it's cool. I never thought about it that way. That's how I always think about it. But, it is, but, I mean, the guitar is a very 90s sound to it, now that I'm hearing it. <laughs> In this context, I mean, I think live, it, you know, you play pretty loud, so I just hear, like, most times I hear... <laughs> That's my preferred guitar tone, live. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The sound of tinnitus slowly being carved into your uh, ear canals. Yeah. Um, we did have a T-shirt of this. 
I remember it felt like a fan favorite, and I feel like we heard 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 that and made a shirt. Or we took the what team because this was, was a single. Teen, it was a Teen Creeps T-shirt. It just said Teen Creeps on it. <laughs> huh. Handwritten. I think from the um, single. There was a te- Teen. The Teen Creeps was oh. a single. Right. Like we didn't the, have a video it for it. Like but the war, it looked like a Warhol kind of camo. Well, that was a racer. But the Teen Creeps one was the one where it's red, and I'm on the cover. It's a still from that film, that short film oh, I made right. in my room. Okay. And that, those pictures are in the Noun CD booklet, but there's that's yeah. the Teen Creeps single. And, yeah, I guess I forget it's a single because we never had a video. And it, it, that was sort of how you delegated what a single was, I guess, in, mm-hmm. in the early mid aughts whatever that's the mid aughts but uh and yeah oh this part's so great the ending part yeah i love this it's so funny and then whose handwriting was that on the single is that yours or brian's i think it was brian's because he also wrote the eraser one was on God, the back. yeah yeah and then we just took that for the shirt team creeps Anyway, That's there's cool. a shirt. We must yeah. have sold them. I don't remember. Put them. that image up right now. <laughs> Do you have it? <laughs> I'm sure somewhere. That's um, so funny. I, I'm like shocked at the amount of stuff I don't remember. Yeah. Well, I remember different things than you. You remember yeah. different things than me. Probably do. Yeah. I mean, but yeah, shirts and record covers are definitely more um, my uh, area of. Um, I get some like dopamine you know yeah all amped up and then i remember it plus the shirts we made at my mom's shop so i think i remember all that shit i probably didn't even <laughs> i doubt i even asked you i just made the shirt probably and said hey <laughs> hey like we start bringing this on tour sweet okay. cool. um, um was it, oh i remember playing this song at um the in-store that um chris tipton set up for us in london do you remember this in-store we played? It was like way across town from wherever we were. I remember we had to take a cab there. When we got there, it was like a crowded, like small shop. Wow. And we set See? up in the I don't back of the that. shop. And we had to like go through. It was like a really crowded shop. I don't know if it was on like a record store day or something. Some excitement was going on in the shop. Embarrassing. And then, uh, I don't remember. And I remember playing this song there. And Tipton was always good at kind of taking the piss out of us. I feel like he heard the song, and I was like, "Whoa, boys!" Like I remember him kind of giving us a, a razzing or something <laughs> about it, how how, uh, maybe how direct it, it was, or maybe how '90s it sounded or something. something. He was good at kind of making fun of us and helping us <laughs> yeah. helping us not take ourselves too seriously. I, I remember him last time. Last time we played in London, he set up the show, and I think we played this song, and maybe. You didn't play that part right. <laughs> that did no, 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 no. He yeah. said he made some funny joke about that somewhere. He, oh, Tipton like, made a oh, joke you, about it. Something. I think he said it to you. I remember. Blew it. He's like, oh, you still can't play that part. <laughs> I feel like maybe that's what it was. <laughs> it was like, I mean. Yeah. Pretty funny. Yeah, I mean, you're kind of setting Good yourself guy. up to fail. Good something guy. Something like that, you know. It's <laughs> just but, so um, simple. Well, it's like. A showstopper, and then all the lights are on you, and go, and you play the yeah. most Boom. simple guitar yeah. right there. Yeah. <laughs> it either works or it doesn't. I mean, I think I think I probably got a good seventy uh, percent batting average on that one. <laughs> yeah, meaning if we played it a hundred times, I've probably played it correct seventy times, and probably biffed it thirty times. Yeah. This so, drum beat's funny because I don't really do this in our, our songs, too. And maybe that's also, it has a feeling of being straight, kind of. Hmm. Boom. The double bop, snare bop, hit. Boom. Boom. Bop, bop, bop. Boom. But I don't really, yeah. I don't do that. And that was also maybe at that time, it felt like, well, maybe right after that, it felt like a thing. There was some, like, that's when the beginning of that surf throwback shit was going down. Ah. Uh. We were not that a part you were of that. Responsible for with by playing that drum beat that was invented 60 years ago. <laughs> no, not responsible yeah, for it. Yeah. I just think it probably. I don't. I'm. It, 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 remi- it, it reminds me of that crowd. a bit. Of that, I think of that time because it. Everyone and I, to be honest, I think it's still happening. But 
a lot of shitty rock yeah. music. Just goes boom, cha cha, boom cha, boom cha cha. And you did your part to put a brick in that wall of the monument of, of that drum beat. Yeah, I'm to I am to blame. Yeah. Well, <laughs> just imagine if a lot of songs did that. Do 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 do. And I had to feel guilty every time I heard somebody <laughs> write a bad song that went do 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 do. I'd feel like I also a, think this like song maybe shouldn't be the most listened song on Spotify for us. <laughs> oh, you should you should write a, a strongly worded letter. You should write a Yelp review about Spotify <laughs> to Mr. Spotify. <laughs> you should complain to the manager. Ask to speak to the manager of Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't think this should be the most listened to song. We've written much more interesting songs than this, Mr. Yeah. Spotify. It's a good song, but yeah. yeah, definitely we have more interesting songs. But I feel like that's part of the interesting part about being a band, right? Or being a musician. That you can write something, you just sort of don't have to think about it. Oh, yeah. We're just it's sort of up to other people to listen to it yeah. the, most, the, the most times on Spotify or not. Oh, yeah. It's a, it's a, I mean, I don't know how many times I've, I've read or heard of groups you know their most popular song is like the song they hate i don't hate the song but that no, sort of i definitely don't hate this song that, that i'm always hoping that ha- <laughs> can i tell you a secret i'm always ho- secretly hoping that happens to us that we oh that one really the song, song we hate gets really popular <laughs> yes <laughs> we don't really write songs we don't keep songs around that we hate so that, it, it's that's always like in a book where it, the record company made them put it out and like oh that song's yes, a throwaway yeah. you got to keep it in there oh it's a piece <laughs> of shit oh god that's the pop hit of course but we don't write sh- songs like that you know so that's i think why i always i always wish it would i'm always secretly fingers crossed that like something somehow something <laughs> something's something gonna like get through happen. like we never thought that would happen that's the stupidest thing ever and then yeah you're on you're a, you're a millionaire drinking champagne and uh eating rolls royces wait you're not i don't know i don't know Are you, i'm not you're not doing that you're i know living, i am ah, that's what living, i do every day living the life Maybe it did um, happen. Well, that's Teen Creeps, y'all. <laughs>